Oh, you've got big ears. Hello. Hello, sweet doggy. You know what that means. I'm talking to animals. It's our pet of the week. Or Gretchen. me. Or, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Gretchen Presley here with the Humane Society of the Pikes Peak Region. You got a little little, uh, little girl here, right? Yes, this is Missy. She Hi, Missy. A two, she's a two-year-old beagle mix. Well, We're guessing oh. maybe some Jack Russell in there, too. You got some Kimberly Jack saw. Russell. Yeah, I think she so, too. She likes the Jack Russell. Uh, all right, well, turn around to the camera, dude, let's, so you can be on TV. There you go, right there. Look, <laughs> there at, look at Brittany. Go look at Brittany. That is uh, Missy. Talk about <laughs> Missy. <laughs> yeah, she came in as a stray. Um, she is very high energy. She hasn't been too bad this morning, though. Um, she likes she, if she does have some Jock Russell, then yeah, yes. she, she's trouble, but she's adorable and she's worth it. She likes so. to give a lot of love and likes yes. to be very uh, adventurous. What do you, now, don't look anything on the ground at Fox 21. Oh, yeah. You never know what's in this <laughs> in the studio. Here. Uh, all right, and uh, she's she's vocal, too, because she's like a beagle, right? She can, actually, she hasn't said much to me this morning, but her, her records say the volunteers say she can be, um, she loves to bark at things outside, so if you're looking yeah. for Somebody to talk to. Maybe this is your girl. Might be uh, better for a house with like, older kids or something like mm -hmm. that. You think? She can be a little bit nervous. Yeah, in new situations and um, again, just the Beagle Jack Russell mix. It's right. Probably older kids that can handle her I know, personality KP's a little Jack better. Jack Russells are terrier. They're crazy. <laughs> I love your dogs, Jack but they're Russell terrors. They're yes. terrors. Yeah. Yes. All right. Her adoption <laughs> fee for Missy. Uh, 130 dollars, and that includes the voucher for a veterinary exam, vaccinations, 30 days of pet health insurance, one year dog license, and a microchip. You say that in your sleep, don't you? I can. Yeah. You're very good at that. Okay. So Missy, a beautiful. Beautiful dog, ready to adopt. This week, you guys are talking about National Poison Prevention Week, and that's very important with all of our animals that we love so much. Mm -hmm. But you can have stuff in the house that could kill them. Oh yes, um, all the common cleaning chemicals, just like with kids, really. As if they get into any of those, they can cause some serious health problems in dogs. Another one that people, I think we all know about, but don't really think about, is chocolate. I mean, really, it can be very toxic right. for animals if they get into it and you aren't expecting it. They can have some serious health problems. Another one that I really wanted to mention is um, for outside cats is antifreeze and yeah. we're kind of moving away from winter but if you spill that it tastes really sweet it draw attracts them to it but it can be very poisonous for them even a tiny bit can cause some serious problems in pets and outside animals yeah we have that uh, information on your screen it's good to pet proof your home and that antifreeze can be very toxic a lot of people may be filling up their cars in the garage or something mm -hmm. because they, it's warmer in there and then that spills onto the ground that's where the cat or dog can get into it and you say even people food can be toxic like exactly. you mentioned chocolate, chocolate but um, other things too Grapes, I know. I heard they're not exactly. good. Exactly. So and and can, do you know about avocados? Because I, I have, I've heard differing things. Like some people say avocados are bad. Other people online, oh, I fed my dog it's avocados and there's no issues. It's fine. Um, I, I have know. not heard of that one specifically okay. as being bad or good for dogs. Um, I can look into that for you and see okay. what I find. Either way, it's mm -hmm. good to make sure you're pet proof your home. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Well, if you'd like more information, oh, look at that doggy right there. Take this dog home right now. <laughs> this is Missy. She's available 11 o'clock today. Go to the website, hsppr.org, for more information on Missy oh, and, of course, on oh, National hi. Poison Prevention <laughs> Week. Oh, now she wants a belly rub. Oh. Can we get a shot of this? Look at this. Oh, you got a belly rub. Okay. All right. I can't really get an angle to you. Thanks, either. Gretchen. Appreciate Thank it. You. There she is. You're ready for your belly rub, aren't you, kitty? Okay. Mm, kitty. I like to call them kitties. <laughs> yes. All right, let's head outside. 827 is your time right now on your Wednesday morning. Hump day. Yes, it is hump day as we look out toward Cheyenne Mountain. You can see what a nice day it is and actually a pretty uh, good start.